Hi there, it's me, Mike. Uh, today we're making a really simple thing. Uh, we're just going to have this cursor. This is a, cur a custom cursor. It's just a picture that I found on the internet. Uh, and we are adding that to our web page. So you could do this for the whole web page. You could do this for just a part of the web page, as you see I've done here. Uh, but it's super simple, and I'm going to show you how. So to start, I've got this section that I want to have the custom cursor. I've given it a class, but you can just assign that to a body uh, if you wanted to do the whole document. Uh, and then in my CSS file, I've got that uh, dot custom cursor. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to type in cursor, uh, and then I'm going to set it to whatever cursor I want. So there's a few built-in cursors, uh, like pointer. Now, oh, whoops, let's see if I can spell pointer. Uh, pointer is one, and you can see that's that pointer effect. That's super useful for like if you want to make like a link or like a button that is actually just a div instead of being an A uh, that still has a href. You can add this pointer effect, and it, it makes it seem more legit. Uh, but we kind of want to do our own. I'll put a, a link in the description with all kinds of different uh, cursors uh, for you to check out. Some of them are cool, like none I like a lot, where it just disappears. Uh, but anyway, uh, to make your own, all you do is you type in URL and then you give the file path to where it is. So like uh, this one is cursor.png. And then you need to give uh, another argument of what it will be if there's no, if it can't load the file correctly. So if it can't load the file, I'll have it be pointed. And that takes one that's built in. Yeah, you can't use another image for that. Uh, so then if I refresh, you'll see that my cursor is there. You'll also see that that is massive. And the reason why is because that's 100 by 100 pixels. Uh, 100 by 100 pixels is the maximum file that they allow. Uh, so it, it makes it super big where it's just this massive cursor. Uh, a more realistic one, I did 50 by 50. I've got another image there. This is just 50 by 50. This is the 100 by 100 one. Uh, so the cursor 50, you can see it's a little more reasonable. It's still super big. I'd probably go for like 20 by 20. Uh, or so if I was actually going to use this because that's kind of massive. Uh, but yeah, that is pretty simple stuff today, but uh, hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, please do like, comment, and or subscribe. Uh, and please have a great day. Thanks for watching.